Welcome to your Go Market Updating Charts of the Day for today. It's the 8th of February 2024. Mike Smith, Senior Analyst of Go Markets, leading you around what's happening in the Asian markets today as we approach the midpoint of the Asian session. Let's have a look at the headlines to start with. Of course, overnight we saw US equities up, new record highs hit. The recent rally is continuing. Big tech continues to grind higher, which is pulling all of the major indices up. About 50-50 in terms of advances versus decliners. But of course, we've got more earnings to come tonight and for next week. But at this stage, things are still looking very positive. US futures are near neutral in early Asian trading. We've seen a slight uptick in the last hour to put them mildly positive. But Asian markets are strongly following that US lead and are generally higher. ASX is up around 0.5%. Materials have bounced after a very soft start to the week and utilities are outperforming. European futures are pointing to a positive open this afternoon. So it looks as though we're going to get a continuation of this momentum across global indices today. Same can't be said for the US dollar index, which has pulled back again for the second straight day from November levels. On the back of that equity strength and gold has bounced off the important 2030 level, sits around 20 40 in the Asian session looks quite bullish today. Copper, however, dropped again overnight, but is holding support in Asia. And the CFD oil contract has edged back towards $75. Looks as though that might be a test of a key level. After being in a short term range, Bitcoin has moved higher again and looks to test the key level at 45,000 at the top of the current trading range. If earnings are going to continue to dominate sentiment. Chinese inflation data has come out and was generally positively received. And US weekly jobs is the data headline tonight. But the charts that call our eye today. We're seeing general weakness in the yen. You can see here on the US yen, we are tackling a key level around 148.30. A move through this could see us up around about 50 to 60 pips towards that 149 level, perhaps a pause at around about 148.80 maybe on the cards but one certainly to watch in the coming hours and on the asx we're looking at harvey norman again moving to the up we've now breached this key level at around about 4.53 and in essence this puts us in a position to move up towards five dollars in the medium term maybe a pause around about 4.85 at one that certainly looks interesting today Trade safe and see you again soon. Bye-bye for now.